my dear sisters and brothers in Jesus Christ. Every year on 8th October, the church celebrates the feast of Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus. Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus were the officers of the Roman army and they were the favorites of the emperor Maximian. Until one day when Saint Maximian went into the temple of Jupiter to offer sacrifice. It was then he noticed that Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus did not enter the temple and offer prayers. Maximian ordered both of them to enter the temple and offer prayers. But Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus refused to do so. They said that we belong to Christ and we offer our prayers to our Heavenly Father. Immediately, the Emperor stripped them of their ranks and paraded them in the streets with women clothing. They were brutally tortured. Even then, they did not change their hearts. Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus, till the last moment, they belonged to the Lord and they proclaimed Christ in their hearts. They were sent to Risafe in Mesopotamia where they were brutally lashed. Saint Bacchus died under the lash and his body was thrown on the streets for the dogs. But the vultures protected his body from the dogs. Saint Sergius was made to walk miles wearing nail shoes which pierced through his legs. He too was later killed. Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus always carried Christ in their hearts. They never gave in whenever trials and tribulations came in their life. They were men of honor and faithfulness. They lived their life in full dedication to the Lord. It was in 431 when Alexander, the Metropolitan of Hierapolis, restored and blessed the church over the grave of Saint Sergius. The great devotion of Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus spread through Eastern Europe. Today, Saint Sergius and Saint Bacchus are the heavenly protectors of the Byzantine army. My dear sisters and brothers in Jesus Christ, as we celebrate the feast of Saint Sergius and Bacchus, let us pray through the intercession of these saints that we too continue to remain faithful to the Lord whenever trial and tribulations come in our life.